Welcome back everyone to another NBA video and in this video I'm going to be talking about the Los Angeles Lakers, a lot of news and rumors going on around LA, so I'm just going to get right into it. So yesterday when we got the reports that Anthony Davis had requested a trade, a lot of people were talking about some trade packages that teams could put together, teams like the Knicks, Celtics, Raptors, and Lakers are going to try to acquire him sooner or later. But anyways, the Lakers, they seem like the front runner and the preferred destination. Anthony Davis was actually fined 50000 for requesting the trade, having his agent request it publicly. I found that interesting because when Jimmy Butler requested the trade, it was public to everyone and he didn't get fined anything. So I'm not exactly sure what that fine was for. But anyways, Anthony Davis, there have been a lot of trade rumors around him and the Lakers and how the Lakers could possibly get that done within the next week before this February 7th upcoming trade deadline. But some other superstars, some other star players are now in the mix for trade targets or signing targets for the Los Angeles Lakers. As this morning, we got reports from Adrian Wojnarowski of ESPN that if Anthony Davis is indeed traded to the Los Angeles Lakers, that Klay Thompson, multiple time NBA champion, three time champion, and Golden State Warriors shooting guard Klay Thompson would be interested in joining LeBron, Anthony Davis, and the Lakers. And then then, later today, we got reports that Kyrie Irving, he's going to be a free agent this summer as well, along with Clay, would be genuinely interested in reuniting and teaming up with LeBron James again. So this could be very interesting, and the Lakers could see this as motivation to get this Anthony Davis trade done, because if you're going to have to give up people like Josh Hart, Brandon Ingram, Kyle Kuzma, Lonzo Ball, if you're going to have to give up almost everything and almost every part of your young core to get Anthony Davis, it might make you a bit more reluctant to do it knowing the risks of giving up four, three or four potential all-stars for the future, but it is Anthony Davis and if they did that and Klay Thompson is interested in coming and Kyrie Irving does make a decision if things don't go the way as planned in Boston, if Milwaukee or Toronto wins the East and Kyrie Irving wants to join, then this whole trade could completely pay off because then in your starting lineup you could have LeBron James, Kyrie Irving, Anthony Davis and Klay Thompson. That would just be like the Warriors 2 .0, and things would shift another team from California. This time the Lakers instead of the Warriors would be the NBA dominant powerhouse and they would win multiple titles you'd think and they would attract some veterans on one-year deals like they got with JaVale McGee and Michael Beasley and Lance Stevenson. They'd be coming there if they're trying to chase a ring. They could be solid role players. So let me know what you guys think about this, these rumors. What should the Lakers give up to get Anthony Davis? And what do you think about Kyrie Irving and Klay Thompson maybe going to the Lakers and maybe being interested if they're able to get that trade done with Anthony Davis? And what are some other free agent targets that the Lakers could get along with Klay Thompson, Kyrie Irving, and trading for Anthony Davis? 